Happiness is the perpetual possession of being well deceived. Live every day as your last, because one of these days, it will be. When I am reading a book, whether wise or silly, it seems to me to be alive and talking to me. If a man makes me keep my distance, the comfort is, he keeps his at the same time. When a great genius appears in the world you may know him by this sign, that the dunces are all in confederacy against him. I have ever hated all nations, professions, and communities, and all my love is toward individuals. As love without esteem is capricious and volatile, esteem without love is languid and cold. Satire is a sort of glass, wherein beholders do generally discover everybody's face but their own. Whoever makes the fewest persons uneasy, is the best bred man in company. You should never be ashamed to admit you have been wrong. It only proves you are wiser today than yesterday. I will no more believe than that the accidental jumbling of the alphabet would fall into a most ingenious treatise of philosophy. When people are met together, a short silence does much improve conversation. The latter part of a wise person's life is occupied with curing the follies, prejudices and false opinions they contracted earlier. The worthiest people are the most injured by slander, as is the best fruit which the birds have been pecking at. The stoical scheme of supplying our wants by lopping off our desires, is like cutting off our feet, when we want shoes. It is useless to attempt to reason a man out of a thing he was never reasoned into. A man should never be ashamed to own that he has been in the wrong, which is but saying, that he is wiser today than yesterday. We have just enough religion to make us hate, but not enough to make us love one another. Some men, under the notion of weeding out prejudice, eradicate virtue, honesty and religion. Power is no blessing in itself, except when it is used to protect the innocent. 